Welcome back to another weekly vlog. I'm so, so happy that you are here. I'm happy to have you. What's today? Tuesday, right? I already did laundry today. Um, I'm, um, I forgot. Oh, Tuesday also means that I'm at the pool today. So this is what I'm gonna be doing. I'm gonna be lifeguarding today. Wait, this needs polishing. There we go. I'm a little bit tired. We had a lot of work to do on Monday and then my morning was also very hectic even though the work that I did was just around our house because our ladies actually left on a camping trip today. Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. So we have those three days kind of free. I say kind of because I think when, while they are gone we're going to be picking cucumbers but we're not going to do anything with them. We're just going to sell them. Yeah, so today's a free day. A free community work day it's still kind of not a free day because we all have work around our houses to do yeah and I've been running around like a chicken with my head chopped off Today is Wednesday and the video that went live today that is already live that you might have already seen this is me planning the not planning writing out the the voiceover that I'm doing so yes I, I like to plan out my voiceovers go over what I want to say I don't like the fan reflection currently listening to a what is it a Christian mix playlist on Spotify they have some pretty good songs but anyways coffee and let's, you know, let's, let's just go do this. I'm gonna put this on the side for now. I have so much here that I have to go through again. <laughs> Making sure I didn't repeat myself. That's something that I have a habit of repeating myself. But anyway what I just did that's what I did just now finish maybe later and, and I'm going to be making pumpkin blondies and I found a recipe on Pinterest so it's a trial recipe I'm excited anyways let's get to cooking I need a break
I also asked my brother's opinion on this, but taste-wise, it's actually okay. It's fairly good. But I don't know what happened with the baking process. Chefs and professionals out there, maybe you can help me out. Yeah, I asked people to help me out and they haven't even seen the recipe. If you look at it properly, you can tell there's something wrong with it. I mean, her recipe did say that it's gluten-free, but when I looked at the ingredients, it said one cup all-purpose flour. I just used my all-purpose gluten-free flour blend, so maybe it could be that. I'm not really sure. <laughs> so these are my notes. I feel like if somebody were to look at these right now and try to read them, it might be a little bit difficult. But anyways, let's continue. Waiting, 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 waiting. Oh, this is Alice, this is Jelaine, and then way back there is Amaris. So this is my camera bag. I put my camera in this when I go walking, it's a lot easier. And Kona knows this bag. She knows what it means. Sha. Sha. Ready? <laughs> she knows that we're going for a walk. <laughs> okay. <laughs> now try and put your shoes on in peace with this. I just made myself a coffee and I thought I would answer a question, a couple questions. In one of my previous videos, I mentioned that our community has been around for 30 years. And then somebody asked me, well, if it's only been 30 years, where were we before that? We actually branched out from a different colony. The most common reason that a colony has to branch out is when they have too many people, when they are too big. We divided the colony in half. Some stayed at the old colony and the rest moved to the new colony, which is our community today. It is currently 2.36, we came home a little before one. We picked cucumbers, we packaged cucumbers, corn, and carrots for our farmer's market. People have also been wondering if I would share my dress pattern or where they could get it. And you know what? I need to take you to the sewing room to explain this one, so let's go. Okay. Little girl dresses. These used to be mine, but anyways, mine is moved. Oh, what did I do? So there's my folder and our book to take. Ah, there we go. So, this is my dress pattern just the bodice and the pocket. Our dress patterns have been passed down through generations. Our dresses are custom made and are altered and designed to fit each individual person. So my dress pattern, it has been designed and altered and fixed and measured all that type just to fit my body perfectly. It was specifically designed and altered to fit me and my body shape. I just wanted to show you and explain a little bit more. A lot of people have told me they are interested in the pattern, if I could share it, and I wish I could. The skirt, so we actually don't have a pattern for our skirts. Everybody knows the length and width of material that they need to create their own individual skirts. It's actually the root beer I made with my mom. Whoa, no, 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 a couple weeks ago. It cannot explode, I just finished cleaning the house. As you might be able to tell by the chairs being up behind me. We wipe the chairs and then put them upside down on the table and then wipe the legs. And then I leave them up there to give them a chance to dry, okay.
I actually I cleaned the house today because tomorrow we are supposed to be getting mushrooms and pineapples and then we're going to be canning them but they're not even here yet so they're they're arriving tomorrow morning and then tomorrow morning we also have to can them so who knows what will happen and man this stuff is good I've never really liked the honey before but it adds something cheers I am gonna go relax for a little bit Supper today is a make your own burrito bowl type thing. There's rice, hamburger meat, um, these are fried wonton wrappers, cabbage, onions, and carrots shredded and stir fried with the sauce. And then we also have fresh corn and cucumbers. It is 8.50 and I just got done with my laundry so I'm gonna go to the kitchen basement because the pineapples and the mushrooms did arrive so we're gonna be canning those today. There's not a lot there so it shouldn't take us too long. And we're going to be switching cameras in three, two, one. It is currently 11 o'clock and we just got home. We're canning pineapples and a bunch of us, the parts of the pineapples, the inside, the core, and I even have a skin in here. I'm going to be freezing them for kefir. There's another thing that you can do with your pineapple skins. Yeah, I got a huge bag. I had to redeem myself, so I quickly whipped up a batch of pumpkin chocolate chip muffins, which in our house are, and never fail, they never fail. But this is the gluten-free and then I need to make another batch, but that's not gluten-free. It's beautiful. I actually just got back from the pool and man, it was glorious. It was just glorious. Okay, so I'm gonna try one of these muffins. Look how beautiful. Well, that was not satisfactory at all, but. They're absolutely divine. Light and fluffy, and they taste just like the regular thing. Busy.